Dateline, Nevada, a strange city is raised in the Black Rock Desert, leading us all to wonder, what is this unholy gathering? Or did what? Dirty men? I have no clue. A Dionysian orgy of free love and pagan worship? Oh, I've heard about them, and I am scared. A frenzied festival of drug-addled fiends? A Bernie man? Isn't that a bunch of hippies running around naked? An apocalyptic celebration of anarchy? It's, it's like a cult. My wife might know. I've never heard of it. I don't know anything about burning bush. Good citizens from across the nation express outrage and confusion. No sé en realidad qué puedo pensar en él. Simplemente puedo pensar que debe estar en su opinión, debe estar correcta. Burning Man's a waste of my time. While issuing a sober warning, don't let Burning Man happen to you. It's not about sex and drugs. Whatever you want to call it, city or festival or community or event. It's not about... Uh, Satan. Quite a party going on out west. Going on over a decade. And it is about Satan. We thought you might like to see up close, up close, what some people have called a proto-apocalyptic, hippie, neo-pagan freak fest. Something big, something powerful. It seems to combine uh, art and music. It's not like Lollapalooza. <laughs> it's almost like a tech industrial fetishism. There. I think many people really think it's just one huge freak show. So if you don't really know somebody who's been here, I think it's pretty hard to really get the picture. This is one of those events that the outside world needs to see at some point. There is a huge man. This guy couldn't explain I couldn't it explain it. That was glowing blue made out of sticks. As much as it's not a religion, people develop a religious kind of fervor around it. It's like we go there for some reason, you know, and I don't know, I'm not sure what we worship. I really do think it's the journey, and it's not so much that final artwork, but getting there. We do it against all odds in the harshest environment, against the wishes of the government often. And they could basically find us, I could go to jail, there could be, uh, you know, very serious repercussions. The real event is the one that happens up here. I want to be part of something that helps change the world. Here's the Larry Harvey for having a lame idea 17 years ago. <laughs> Tell you the truth, I don't know if I'm all that eager to get there. I mean, what happens when you get there? <laughs> it costs money to run a city for six days. Yes, yes, it does, and that is a big question. Thousands of people doing the strangest things getting along. You're doing a documentary to try to find out what it is. I hope you don't find out. I don't think you can. Interesting thing is it looks like we know what we're doing, huh? <laughs> <laughs>